Time now is 647. I know the plants outside are dry and they're going to get a little more heat. Mm -hmm. I know, right? You know, it's, well, it's kind of hard. You got to figure out, you know. You do have to figure out like what to save, what to keep. Sure. And you know, we did have that Mother Nature's rainfall. It came through on Sunday and now all of a sudden we're talking about record breaking heat in the forecast. So let's kick things off with your first alert weather. And this is what we're dealing with today. It's a cold front just off the coastline. A few clouds associated with it will be streaming into the area. The rainfall that it is producing now we're not going to really get in on that. Most of that's going well up to the north of us through parts of Oregon and Washington. On the other hand, we will have a few clouds coming through in a nice onshore flow, especially closer to the coastline. That's going to help curb today's afternoon highs. Yesterday we hit 94 in downtown Sacramento. Today temperatures just a little below the mark. 92 coming in for the valley, upper 80s coming in for the delta. Mid 80s for afternoon highs coming in for the foothills and the mid 70s for the Sierra. 69 today for the Bay Area with a nice breeze coming in out of the west around 20 miles per hour. So today we are in the 90s. Tomorrow we have our first day of the opportunity for triple digit highs in the forecast. And then we will turn our attention to what could be record breaking heat with an excessive heat watch moving in for Friday. So here's the seven day forecast today, the lower 90s. Thursday, the first day with the opportunity for very dangerous heat near triple digits expected Friday up to 105, which could be a new record. The last time we saw temperatures that hot was back in 1918. We hit 105 in downtown Sacramento. 100 is the forecasted high for Saturday, and then we get to Sunday. We do have another system that moves closer to the area, a weather disturbance. It's not going to really bring us any rainfall per se, but it will help cool us down to near seasonal highs. That is a look at your weather this morning. Right now with a look at your traffic, Christina. Thank you very much.